Hi everyone, it's Ella here and welcome. Today's workout, short and sweet, just under 30 minutes in total. After warm up, we've got four different rounds. Each round we have three different exercises, 20, 20, 20 with 20 seconds recovery in between. So we work one minute, uh, nice and hard. Uh, we have 20 seconds recovery and we're gonna do that three times. In between rounds, there will be longer recovery, it will be 40 seconds recovery. So I'm sure you're gonna feel awesome after this workout. So let's put the mind into it, uh, do your best, enjoy, and let's do it. So guys, as always, let's start with the warm up and good posture. Bring the shoulders up, back and down, push your belly button into your spine. Your knees are nice and unlocked, and legs, hips with a five toes pointing forward. We're gonna start warming up upper body, your shoulders by circling your arms backwards. Everybody will have a different range of movements and that's okay. Just make it as big circles as is possible for you. Open and close. Nice and easy breathing, don't hold your breath. This is just to warm up, wake up our bodies. Open and close. You're gonna change direction and circle your arms forward. All large circles. Almost there. And squat down. Hop. Down and up. Squeeze your tummy. Push your bum back and down. Chest up. Knees striking your toes. Go down, up, down, up. We're gonna change the squats for lunge forward. Right leg, right, left. Chest up, two knees 90 degree. Lunge to the side, go. Chest up, take your last step, so your toes, or your knees are not going over your toes, and give me a big, big smile now, because we're going to feel really, really well, good afterwards. Last two, lunge backwards. Out and in your legs, chest up, down, down, starting to feel a little bit warmer, that's a good sign, jog, nice and light jog, if you rather to keep it low impact, that's totally fine, just march, so high impact or low impact, it depends on what level you're at at this moment. Still warming up. Jumpy jacks go. Wind now. Again, low impact. Totally fine. So you choose the levels. You're up now. Nice strong arms. The whole way up. The whole way down. And you're jumping on the ball of your foot. Feet wide. Heel back. Again, low impact. Especially if this is your warm up. You can keep it nice and gentle and low impact. It depends what level you are. Nice strong arms. Doing good. Lunge jumps. Hop. Doesn't have to be very low. Have a lunge is okay. Four more. 
three more. Three more. Jog high knees. So you're trying to bring your knees to your hip level. Almost there. Keep breathing. Feet together. Side to side jump. Soften your knees. And back to the march. Take deep breath in through your nose, out through your mouth, and get motivated, get ready to the main workout. Just over 18 minutes, let's do it. Let's go, let's enjoy. Okay guys, main workout. We've got four rounds, and each round we're gonna do three different exercises. We're gonna do them 20, 20, 20, with a 20 seconds recovery. So you're working as hard as you can, for one minute using three different exercises and then you've got 20 seconds of recovery and we do them three times in between the rounds we've got a longer recovery we're gonna need that longer recovery so let's go let's do it first three exercises first one we've got a skater's lunge so you jump to the side you bring that foot as far back as is possible and really really good exercise for your glutes the second exercise, so it's gonna be glute bridges. Lift your hips off the floor as high as you can and just tap your toes. And the third exercise, it will be quick transition, up, down, up, down from the floor. We're gonna do squat and lift, squat and lift. Are you ready? Let's go, let's do it. 20 seconds, skaters lunge, let's go. Keep it going. That's our first round. Stay focused. Second exercise, glute bridge. Good round. Work on your legs and your glutes. So knees directly over your feet. And you want that chest, hips, and knees in the line. Transition, squat, lift. So high lift. Keep breathing. Still keep smiling. It may get a little bit harder. 20 seconds recovery. So drink water whenever you need to during the workout. Stay hydrated, just grab water, whatever you feel like. So back to for exercise one. Are you ready? Let's go. In your own speed, you can go a little bit faster or take your time. Keep it safe, make sure nothing is around which could hustle your quick transition. Shoulders down away from your ears, palms facing up, squeeze. On the floor, go. Squat, lift, squat, lift. That's it, 20 seconds, I'll recover after this. So squat a little bit lower and lift your leg a little bit higher. Breathe. Well done, 20 seconds recovery. Grab water, quick drink. Give your body a shake. And we're gonna go one more time with those three exercises. Push it, push it in a minute as hard as you can. Push that bone back and down so that knee is never going 
over your toes. Transition, left, go. So heels up, down, up, down. Like you will be marching. Wait for the beep. Transition, go. Lift, squeeze, squeeze, go, go, up, flex to the foot, and well done. We've got 40 seconds recovery, and I'm going to explain the next exercises. So we've got press up, knee in, in, press up, then you lie down on the floor, Lift your chest up off the floor, rest your arms, and the last one, shoulder taps. So really, upper body round, working as hard on as your, on your upper body as you can. 20, 20, 20, let's go. Press up, knees in, and knees in. Drop that chest, nice and low your elbows a little and drop on your knees anytime you want to. Breaststroke arms, lift that chest of the floor, nice and low the spine, look down. Squeeze, Shoulder taps. You want them hands underneath or above your shoulders. And you don't want to twist your hips too much. You don't want your hips too high or too low. 20 seconds recovery. Keep that core nice and tight. When you do your press up, you want your back nice and flat as well. How are you doing? Second time, breathe on your knees or on your feet. Let's go. As many repetition as you can make on each round.
and good job. 40 seconds recovery. The third round, three cardio exercises. So you can do low impact or you can do high impact. We twist, tuck jump, twist, tuck jump, or squat, we jump and squat. Second exercise, squat to repeat. Stand up, a little bit easier when you just swap your legs like this. And another one, jumpy jacks and squat down on jumpy jacks and squat down. Let's go, first exercise. Go, go, go. Do as many repetition as you can. Squat to burpee. You're pushing this round really hard. This is the top one. Jumpy jacks, squat. <laughs> Don't fix your hair or you're gonna lose the momentum. <laughs> well done, 20 seconds recovery. And we're gonna be do two more times. So your heart is up, you start sweating, and you're pushing strong, as strong as you can. Let's go. Another one, but I really like this one. Round. Go a little bit faster if you can. Heavy, heavy breathing. 40 seconds recovery. The last round will be typical. Just make sure your core is nice and tight 
and your back is nice and flat. C, crunch. Push that belly bottom into your spine. Lift that chest up nice and high. And try to reach to your ankles. Breathe out. In. Mountain climbers. We're gonna do one, two, three, stop. One, two, three, stop. Keep that bum down. No hips up in the air. Everything nice and flat. Leg raises. Push that tummy in. More advanced, you can lift your chest on the floor. 20 seconds recovery. How are you doing? We're almost there. Two more rounds. Quick blast. You don't need much time. If you work hard enough, also 80 minutes. Plenty. Do every day something. Let's go. Push. Imagine you've got a medicine ball in your hands and you want to throw that imaginary ball forward. One, two, three. Just 
don't overstretch, it's not safe. Just comfortable, nice stretches. Change your work. At this point, you can just close your eyes and relax. Nice deep breaths. Put that leg down on the floor. And we're gonna stretch hamstring on the other leg. Drop that leg up higher. Flex your foot. Point. Flex. Point. Flex. And point. Two legs up, bring them wide and press on your inner thighs. Gently bend your knees, bring your knees close together and gently rock your body side to side until you move to the side and lift yourself up on the floor. We cast stretch, so shoulders over your hands, head down, push your middle upper back up towards the ceiling. And relax. Sit back down on your heels. Stretch that arms in front of you. And press that shoulder down towards the floor. Lift your hips off the floor. One foot forward. Make sure that knee is not going over your toes. And gently press that hip down towards the floor. Back of the arm stretch. And change your work. So keep the hips square towards the floor and bring them nice and low. And relax. Put your hands down on the floor. Lift your bum up on the floor. Bend your elbows and drop the elbows down towards the floor. Head down. Whenever you're ready, bring your feet closer together and gently, slowly come up on the floor. Shoulders up, back and down. Grab your hands together behind and stretch your chest. Knees unlocked. Tummy in. Nice and easy breathing. Give it a wee shake. And one arm across your chest, shoulder stretch. How did you get on? Sure you did brilliantly. You can be proud of yourself. Just each time try to do, 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 do this notch more and more to progress. And always go as you feel. Get away with shake. Give yourself a big clap. Well done. I will see you very, very soon, I hope. And keep safe, keep healthy, and keep fat.